Hi! Welcome back to our Miitopia playthrough. Today, we are headed into the castle to fight off the Dark Lord Tanuki Dan once again. And this time, there is something slightly different. You'll notice above me, right here, we got ourselves a brand new horse. It's a Pona! And in addition to that, I got a hot tip. If you use a Link amiibo like I have right here, someone in the party can dress up as Link. I'm super excited for that. But for now, let's feed our party and make sure that we are ready to get going on our adventure. I know that a lot of us seem to want some food and we do have four pieces of food for all four of our party members. Now the problem is that none of us like Goblin Ham. But I still think it's worth it to feed Goblin Ham. So first I'm going to give it to... I'm first going to give some Goblin Ham to Zoe. Zoe only dislikes it as opposed to uh, hates it, which is enough. And then I'll give the second to myself because I want everyone else to have the good food. Now we got two sharp stews. Between the heat and the spikes, it's best not to touch the bowl. Let's go ahead and give this to the two people that we did not feed. Space Junk gets one. Delicious. And Magic Up and Defense Up. That's awesome. And Sacco. Delicious. Loved it. Wonderful. All right. Now that everyone's fed, we can't very well buy anything new for anybody because we only have 27 gold. I think we're going to set off for now with our wonderful party. I am also going to try to put, I think, Sacco into the pen with uh, with Epona because I think that if Sacco can get extra damage off of uh, helping out with Epona, that will be amazing. But first, let's go see Nintendo Fanatic over here. I want to show you my Link Amiibo. You're becoming quite the expert. It's hard to pick a favorite, understandable. I showed you my favorite last time. Yes, I have a Link Amiibo. Moment of truth. Amiibo are so great. Why don't you take this? We got Link clothing. Now the question is, who wears the Link clothing? Let's take a look. Stuff. All right, who gets to wear the Link outfit? I get to wear the Link outfit, but oh, it's so low. Okay, who else can wear the Link outfit? Sacco? Sacco can, so anyone can wear the Link outfit. Okay, so anybody can wear the Link outfit, and I think I'm gonna have Sacco wear the Link outfit. Sacco is our heaviest hitter, and I feel like it just fits perfectly to have Sacco as Link. Uh, just. Our, our hero, the damage dealer. This is perfect. The rest of us will, uh... Why not just, just wear our normal clothes? All right, we're finally getting into the castle. We have our letter. Hello, Ernie. Yes, you can. We have our letter. All right, now we can head on through. We were blocked just not too long ago. And the first thing that we have is a treasure chest on the right, but we can't get it yet. All right, let's go in here. We are setting off with our trusty steed and friends. Let's go. Oh, what do we see? Wow, oh, I can see the castle. Yes, we're, we're inside of the castle. That is generally how that works. Wonder if there's a princess living there. Princesses are always in another castle. That's, that was a good one. You got me, that's a good one. Oh, there's a fork in the road. Lever or game ticket? Oh, I, want, oh, I want to see what this lever is all about. You can't just, like, give me a lever to pull and not expect me to go to it. Are we already there? We're already at the lever. What's this? It's a lever. Uh-huh. Push it. Absolutely pull it. Let's go. That sounded like a good noise. But the treasure chest is open! We can go to the, see the treasure! Hidden path! That's awesome! Oh, and our journey comes to a close after a couple of encounters. The horse didn't do much, but I, I think it's because nobody's really bonded with the horse yet. 
Um, I am gonna go ahead. Yeah, what makes this hard is like, not one of our team members has to be alone. Uh, it does seem like the horse, it, it, okay, it seems like Epona wants to, wants to meet with Sacco. Let's, let's, let's take a look, see. Yeah, let's, let's go ahead and do this. There you go. Now the horse and, and Sacco are, are bonding. Let's take a look. <gasps> Sacco's also feeding Epona a carrot. Such a good horse. Pona found it delicious. Where are we getting these carrots from? All right, I'm definitely gonna keep them in there. And I'm gonna take a look at our bonds. So, I mean, honestly, our bonds are pretty good already. Like, I don't see anything else I can do. I might have, I might have Zoe and Space Junk uh, go ahead and talk because I have the best relationship with Space Junk and Sacco's in the in the uh, in the in the barn area, so that seems like the best play for now. Uh, let's go on an outing though. Let's be getting to know each other better. Let us go to the seaside, and we're gonna have we're gonna have Space Junk and Zoe go together on an adventure. Look at this. This is glory. The, the, this is so gorgeous. The beach is gorgeous. A bottle. Is it a message in a bottle? What's inside? What could it be? Uh-huh. A game ticket! That's pretty- that's pretty cool. And look at that! Excellent bond. Level up. Learned concern. Wonderful. Bonding is also important because we gotta learn these skills. 4 HP bananas as a souvenir is wild. Um... Let's see your other bonds. So I could get to know the horse better, but I'm beyond that. I know everyone else pretty well. Let's go on an outing. Let's go on another outing. I'm gonna go to let's go to the library again. I like the library. Let's go with Sacco to the library. Yes, a duck and Link are walking together to go read books. Nothing is wrong with this. A library brimming with books. Gotta read and you don't. It's really okay. Good luck with- no kidding. Oh no. <laughs> That's a lot of reading material. I grew old. <laughs> I'm like 85 years old. Alright, we also learned concern. Okay. Was it worth becoming 85 years old to learn concern? I, I don't, I don't quite think so. Uh, okay. So it seems like I want a new weapon. How much does it cost? We want a chef's dagger, which is 570. Let's take a look at the arcade. Is there a chef's dagger in the roulette wheel? There's a silver staff. Jolly jaunt tickets. I've never heard of the jolly jaunt. A royal portion of experience or one MP candy. Only one of these are bad. I'm gonna go ahead and take a spin on the roulette wheel and see what we get. Stopping. No, no, okay, okay. I'll take the royal portion of XP. I will 100% take the royal portion of XP. I thought it was gonna land on MP candy for a second there. Uh, let's give the XP, I'm gonna give it to Sacco. 367 experience points. Snap out of it, snap a friend out of it when they're not themselves. That is so much experience. Let's give it another try. And then we'll use the last one to play rock, paper, scissors. Okay. Is that the silver staff? Is that the silver staff? Space Jug's getting a new weapon. Let's go. Look at that. Space Junk could obviously use it. Look at that, 20. Three attack and 29 damage. You've been using that hammer for a while. It's time for an upgrade. Congratulations. And finally, let's see if we can get some money by playing some rock, paper, scissors against the robot. We are going to continue with it again. The chronicles of only picking paper in rock, paper, scissors. We tied. 
Okay. Now. What beats paper? Scissors. So I bet that the robot thinks I'm gonna play scissors, so we should play rock. There's a win. I also messed up my process there, so it's a good thing I messed it up because if I had actually done my process, uh, we would have lost. Do I feel a lucky streak coming on? Honestly? I mean, we could get the chef's dagger with just 500 though. No, I'm backing out, I'm backing out. We're gonna get our new dagger. We're gonna get our new dagger with our 500 gold. 769 coins, nice. Let's just go ahead and get our new weapon. I think that this is the play. All right. Yeah, look at that. That's a big old dagger. <laughs> it's also got a pink handle, which I think is really nice. All right, now we can go ahead and set off once more through the castle. All right, we are setting out. I think this time we're actually going to go to get this treasure. It's a hidden path. It must have something good in it. All right, we're already back at the end. Just had to go get the treasure. Brief, brief, brief stop to get the treasure. Sacco and the horse are now growing closer. They're acquainted. Mounted attack. I think that this is going to be really awesome if Sacco uses it. That's going to be a lot of power. Let's check in. Opona really liked that carrot. And they're already glowing clo- They're already growing closer. Like, how- How perfect is it? That Sacco dressed up as Link is getting to know Epona so well. We're in saddle up together. Take a load off with a horsey ride. That's pretty sick. Okay, Zoe and Space Chunk seem to know each other well. Now, I'm going to try to get to know Zoe a little bit better this time. Let's also go ahead and eat. Uh, Okay, so half of us like Banshee Tears and half of us don't. Unfortunately, everybody is drinking Banshee Tears. Sorry, it's the only food I've got, and you're hungry. Sorry, I, I can't- I can't do more for you. Uh, sorry. <laughs> this looks so- so dejected. Not that tasty. Hey, it's still magic up though, that's pretty good. Alright! Ooh! We want some new clothes though. Whoa, the leather vestments look really nice. And the bee armor. Let's get some bee armor. That's up defense. Yeah, very nice. Now, for Sacco, because we're using the special Link armor, I'm only going to equip the stats so that Sacco can still be our good friend Link while still getting the defense benefits. And now we will set off on our journey once more. Quick pit stop just to get the treasure chest. I think that was a good decision. We got a new outfit for our good friend, Zoe. Uh, now we shall resume along the path of the castle. Oh. Why, who are you, my good friend? This is... Such a mild flavor bouquet with a subtle balance of sweetness. Even the aftertaste is heavenly. Like a custom fresh with You really love your food, don't you, buddy? Hi, who are you? You are the Roman gourmet Flavio. Hello, Flavio. The hottest hot cuisine moves me to ecstasies of emotion. I'm gonna share this bliss with you. Three very rare cheesecakes. Bon appetit. That was nice of him. We found it in. All right, we're trying these cheesecakes like now. All right, let's do it. Let's eat some grub. We have so much food. All right, three cheesecakes. These do so much. I'm gonna go since we only got three instead of four. Super. Oh, 
Holy heck! That's so much stat increase! That's absolutely wild! That's still like so much stat increase even though you didn't like it. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and give myself some, some mushroom because like I didn't get to eat anything. HP up, very nice. Alright. That is good enough on the food for now. And we do have some gold. Can we afford... We cannot afford that. Can we afford the armor? Three hundred ten. Barely not. No arcade tickets either. I think that we're just gonna have to set off. Um, before we do that though, I actually want to rotate out Sacco from hanging out with the horse. And we're gonna let other friends get to know. So let's let Space Junk get to know the horse. And I have... We have the same relationship level. So I'm gonna go ahead and still let myself get to bond with Zoe, and then after that, uh, Saka will bond with Zoe. So for now, let us set off. Overall, we have some pretty strong bonds in the party that I'm happy about. Okay, we have a special event inside this part of the castle. I think we're gonna go see the king? Who is the king? And who is the princess? And who is the prince from a nearby land? And who is the noble son? Wow. Look at all this royal court. And there's a love triangle. I like how it specifies that there's a love triangle happening here. It's it's like, it's kind of a love triangle, I guess. Um, but it doesn't say like who the princess loves, so maybe not. Okay, after checking, the princess has gone to our good friend. Olive. Olive is going to be our princess for the playthrough. Now, who will the rest of the royal party be? That is the question. Now, our good friend Voracious hasn't gotten much screen time. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to give our good friend Voracious the opportunity to be not only the postman, but also the king. I think that Voracious is more than worthy of being our king for this playthrough. And finally, we must settle on the rest of the royal party. Let's see who we got. I do think that all we are going to do is put in the king and the princess, as those were some requested roles. The rest shall be... I believe the default. I think that that will work best for us. There we go. These are our default me's. Let us continue with our wonderful playthrough. Greenhorn Castle, here we are. Why, hello. Oh, hi, Ernie. This is King Voracious's castle. Mind your manners. Understood, I will absolutely do that. Would never do anything to hurt King Voracious. Who's this? Oh. Oh, hello, Voracious. King Voracious, what business have you here? The Dark Lord attacked the town of Greenhorn. It's true. I'm telling you the whole... Yes, the Dark Lord stole people's faces. We don't believe it? Oh dear. Hey, your face is gone. <laughs> I wasn't lying. I wasn't lying. And Voracious's face has instantly been stolen. All the way over there? We have to save the King of Greenhorn. We have to do it. You're just like... Royal support. It's a lot of work supporting the King. <laughs> you gotta be really committed. You gotta take it super seriously. It seems you can't go in. Alright. Uh, well, I'm glad that that encounter went that well. Clearly, it went incredibly well. Good. Uh, now our goal is to just get the king's face back, so let's do it. First assist, saddle up! Nice. Now we got Saka riding opponent. Oh. HP bananas are delish. It's true, they are. So soft, so squishy. Sweet, but not too sweet. I could eat them all day, every day. Well, 
Yeah, they're nanners. And an encounter. Ooh, this is a new enemy. We have a mole. We're fighting a mole and a banshee. The horse wants to get in on the action. Let's do it. Mounted attack. And I'm going to target the mole. Let's do it. Well, that's really unfortunate, huh? 11 damage, though. Wait, you just chuck 12 damage? All right, let's go. Sacco does mount attack on the mole again. 34! That's what you get for throwing rocks. 34 damage. Absolutely wild. 15 damage. Oh, wow, I'm super weak. All right, uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go ahead and use some HP sprinkles. I could use some. All right, now let's just attack. Uh, this honestly should be it for the Banshee. After one or two more attacks, 13 damage, one more should be it. Nine, easy. That's it. That mole, though, I was not expecting them to just throw a rock at my face. All right. And now we are back home. We got a letter. My hu my honey is so kind and handsome boot. Here's hoping you find your bliss too from Pookie. Got three adding tickets. That's real nice. Okay. Oh, you want to go to Sacco's room? Okay, we can make that happen. Let's let's check on the team first. Let's see. I assume that space junk is gonna feed Epona. <gasps> what do you want? Down that? An apple! Wait. Oh, okay, so the horse had the carrot and space junk had the apple. That's, that's awesome. Now they're acquainted. Wonderful. That's awesome. All right, now we can change the room. This gives us a perfect opportunity to replace this. And now they can talk. Space Junk brought a present. Surprise. This is for you. A violin. Sacco is very pleased. That's super sweet. Maybe Sword of Legs. Level 5. Learn Praise. Zozo Bear likes Space Junk and saw it all. Always Sacco. Zozo Bear is jealous of Sacco. How are you supposed to fix this? I don't know what to do here. I didn't sign up for this. Let's go ahead and not worry about that for now. Let's eat some food. Strata Sunday. Uh, let's see who needs more defense and who needs defense and speed the most. Zoe definitely needs speed, so let's go ahead and do this. All right, Zoe liked it. That's good. Uh, who else needs speed? Sacco definitely needs speed, so let's give... We found another favorite food of Sacco's, and speed is up. That's amazing. All right, slime jelly. Let's go ahead and give this to Space Junk, who loves it. And then I will give myself some Banshee Tears. Wonderful. All right, that'll work for now. Now let's go ahead and... Ooh. Polka dot gear or I'm gonna go ahead and get polka dot gear. This is what we have money for. Let's see. Yeah, nice polka dot gear. Perfect. Uh, obviously, gotta go with the purple because gotta love purple. I like how the handle matches the clothes. And now we shall set out once more for the day.
Oh, I see that we have a winding path. Oh, we can go straight to the arid frontier. I We definitely need to go get the king's face back first. We need to go into the wayward woods. We have to get the king's face back before we jump in there. So let's go ahead and set out through the woods. Okay. What is happening here? Get a lungful. It's fresh air. I might even go for two lungfuls. Thanks, trees, for all this clean air. Yeah, thank you, trees. Save the trees. We found a treasure chest. What's inside? A lollipop staff for space junk. Heck yes. 30 attack, 36 magic. These stats are going through the roof, y'all. And we found a smaller treasure chest. What's inside? A game ticket. This is perfect. After all, you know, sometimes you gotta gamble with something. Back at the inn now. We've rescued 100 people. We got a gift of divine power as a result. HP sprinkles upgrade. Total HP sprinkles rose from 25 to 30. MP sprinkles rose from 10 to 15. The people's gratitude has awakened new power within you. Truly, you are a beacon of hope for all of Metopia. All right, may continue smiting monsters. You'll get your next perk once you reach 150 people. Hop to it. All right, wonderful. So far, so good. Oh, check on the team. Who's ready for some pampering? Here's a treat. I don't. Aww. Whoa! <laughs> oh, that's so sweet. Pair acquainted. Oh. That's awesome. And now all of us are, 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 are bonded with the horse, too. This is wonderful. Now, the question is, I'm going to put Sacco and Zoe in a room together. And then let's go ahead and have Space Junk get to know the horse a little bit better as well. And now... That will be our layout for next time. We're gonna go ahead and feed everybody here. Let's go ahead and, and give, <laughs> give Sacco his favorite food. And then the rest of us will have some wonderful uh, Banshee tears, even though they're not wonderful for one of these party members. I am sorry, Zoe. Uh, I don't have any other food for you. And <laughs> I'll take one for the team next time, I promise. And with that, I think that will do it for our Metopia adventure today. We are making progress. We've met the king and we're about to save his face. So join us next time as we retrieve the face of the king again. Maybe another encounter with Chinooki Dan the Dark Lord? Who knows what's to come in this wonderful adventure. Thank you all so much for watching. Thank you for being a part of it. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, feel free to leave a comment if you have any suggestions. And till next time, take care. You're wonderful. And I hope that you have a great day. See ya.